Hello everybody and welcome back. So we are doing a lightsaber unboxing. It feels like forever. I don't think it's been forever. It feels like forever. It might just be because I'm particularly excited about this one because this is another saber project saber, which are lightsabers that, well, lightsaber so far that I enjoy quite a lot. If you've seen me spin a lightsaber, it was most likely a saber project. Uh, the, I think it's called the Patronus. Got it, uh, I think about a year ago now, and it has served me very well as my favorite flow saber and my favorite, favorite, my favorite saber overall. So when the guy who sold me that told me he was selling another one of his saber project sabers, at a, uh, he graciously gave me a good price on this one. Unlike the last one, this one is actually a NeoPixel, and I'm actually curious about this one as well, because it has a little bit uh, of... It has a thing in the way of the choke point, which, if you know me, know that I'm not a fan of that. But it's a Saber Project Saber, so I'm curious if they somehow manage to avoid that problem. Why is it so dirty? Ooh. The... The... Geprosh... Geprochanvisung. Or instruction manual, just in German. Great. So, wait, did he translate ever? Nope, he did not. Why, why would he? Uh, it's in German. Uh, I will give my German friends a call if I run into. Wow, this is a very thorough manual, actually. I mean, not that I know, it's in German. There it is. All right, away with your smelly box. Very nice. Oh, it feels great. So I believe they only sell these in um, as NeoPixels now, which is a shame because the uh, CFX non NeoPixel ones are very great. So I hope, I bought like one of those pucks that turned NeoPixels into uh, tricrease. So I hope that arrives soon so I can actually use this thing properly. Ooh, that's a, that goes deep, actually. Yeah, they might have designed this actually very well because the like, the pins, the saber goes all the way down here. Okay, interesting, interesting. This will be interesting. Um. Oh, it opens in the middle, of course. Holy shit, that's satisfying. Have you ever unscrewed something and it makes this sound? Not the squeaky one? Holy shit, that's nice. Oh. Oh. Wow, that snuck. Nice blinky buttons. Very Star Wars-y. It's so satisfying how snug that is. Seriously, listen to that. There's not one squeak. Let's get a blade in. Let's get a blade in. Blades, blades, blades. Where are my nipples, please? They are over there. Uh, there we go. Even holding it up here, like it's it's not the most comfortable thing, but it's like, it's small enough that it's not uncomfortable. But yeah, definitely too happy to be holding it here. So what's the other button do? Oh, it's battery indicator. Ooh, that's actually very comfortable. You could just one button. I forgot. I love the two button setups. <laughs> there seems to be something wrong with, um, that's not right. Is there something wrong with this tip? All right, can someone tell me what's going on? This is now the second NeoPixel lightsaber that I've gotten where the tips aren't lighting up for me. The last one I had was a Golden Harvest. This is a CFX. Why is this happening? Everything sounds good, very responsive. 
There's a nice resonance out of the bottom here. I will say I'm really enjoying the little buttons here. Like That has been the, oh wait, hang on, I don't even know the name of this thing. The Legitus, Lichatus, 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 I don't know how to pronounce that. That has been the Lichatus. Beautiful little saber, very nicely done. Uh, I prefer my other one over this one, of course, just, you know, only because of this really. I think the two, the new two button set, setup is really freaking cool. I haven't seen a saber do that yet. Uh, so that's very cool, very Star Wars-y. That's cool for... Uh, cosplay reasons as well if I had like a little deering on this I had it hanging in with blinking lights very very Star Warsy. Uh I think the color scheme is very nice it's all silver with a little touch of gold I think maybe a little bit more on the emitter would have been nice uh, the leather brown good choice I believe they also do it in black that would also have been a good choice uh, it sounds good it looks good it feels pretty good uh, I'm gonna get like a coupler and a uh, quick release coupler for my two so I can spin these guys around and do some sick moves with my two saber projects. But yeah, I can't wait for that puck to arrive so I can actually use this properly with a blade that isn't heavy, like twice as heavy as the, as the hilt itself. But yeah, there you go. A beautiful little saber from Saber Project. Uh, I want all of them. I'd like to buy uh, 11 more. Uh, I'll get to it at some point. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. I have been Stony Magnum. If you want to support me, I am on TikTok, Instagram, up to all sort of sh sorts of shenanigans. Uh, we got a merch store going where you can find a lot of cool Star Wars merch and support the channel. So support your fashion sense and support me. Win-win situation, right? So yet again, I have been Stony Magnum. You have been wonderful. And I will see you guys in the next one. Mm -hmm.